Restaurant Brands International, the company that owns Tim Hortons and Burger King, is set to report its first quarter earnings on Monday. Last quarter, it reported a loss due to the cost of the merger, but noted that key sales figures were higher. Barrick Gold holds its annual meeting Tuesday amid opposition from some big shareholders over its approach to executive pay. Barrick Chairman John Thornton earned total compensation worth $12.9 million in 2014. Some of Canada's biggest energy names post their first quarter earnings this week, and they probably won't be pretty. Crude prices hovered around the $50 US a barrel mark during the first three months of the year, less than half of what they were last summer. BCE reports its first quarter results on Thursday. The telecom giant has been grappling with the defection of wireless subscribers to competitors following a CRTC rule change that cut the span of wireless contracts to two years. Also on Thursday, Statistics Canada is expected to release its latest reading on the economy with gross domestic product figures for February. Economists expect the agency to report the economy shrank by 0.2% for the month. From the Canadian Press, I'm business editor Leanne Goodman.